you. What terrible lighting. Good morning. But here is Katie, Hello. who is also lit terribly. <laughs> this lit is like you're lit. That means how old are we? That means like you're Trendy. yeah yeah. I'm lit. <laughs> um, this welcome back to a vlog I know it's been a bit of a while since I vlogged very sorry about that but we're here now um, I think this is gonna be a very chatty one because we're going on a bit of a road trip we're going to Oxford Shire, Oxford um, to go to Mr Village which we've never been which to I before. thought was called Bicester she did she thought it was Bicester she's like what time should we get to Bicester and I'm like <laughs> even my mum was like it's cool lighting um, so we were just talking about what we're in the market for and we both ooh, we both kind of said nothing and everything would you say yeah I have nothing but I would like equally to. would like to have a look about yeah have a little mooch um, we originally were gonna go and have two days and go and have like a little mummy vacay but then mum life actually set in and we realised we couldn't actually do that so we're just our schedules to... don't coordinate do they? <laughs> they don't um, all this is a little shop here for um, sustenance little diet coke on the road um, oh no sorry I've done the wrong oh, goodness me sorry <laughs> it's we're so about... and actually you know what I think you can get round oh okay phew look at the weather today it's absolutely glorious I put my autumn but... boots on for the first time but, but it is... I don't know if I've made a fatal error no like how hot do your ankles get, you know? It's not like wearing a coat, it'll be fine. She said, I've, I've fast pressed, forward no, five I've hours, Katie's no like coat. wilting somewhere. Hold on, oh, yeah, oh no. Yeah, I pressed no coat. I, I think we're... No, I think we've missed the chance for a Diet Coke. Don't give up hope, I can see okay. it. Jump over the hill. Okay. No, that's oh, the motor. No, it's okay. Really, no, it's we're right. really literally going back on it. Okay, well, you know what? <laughs> There'll Bye -bye. be another offer. Um, I really would like to look in the Joe Malone shop for perfume. Um, I used to have this perfume from Joe Malone that was English oak and red currant, I think. Don't quote me on that. And it was like the best perfume I've ever had. And when I wore it, Katie, mm. it gave me power. Oh, wow. Yeah. Mm. Like, I felt confident. I wore and... Joe. Sorry, I just completely no, interrupted. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. It's like. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, 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 sure. Um, I had uh, Jo Malone for my wedding scent. Oh, lovely. And the pomegranate noir. Oh, nice. Please I probably won't repeat my wedding scent because that didn't end mm. well for me. Mm. Um, the scent or the wedding. <laughs> um, <laughs> we're going to go to Vista. Um, it's going to be great. And we'll take you along. We're gonna have I'll, some lunch, are we? Oh yes. Sorry, you're trying to stop. No, it's okay. And we're gonna. I'm gonna talk more in the car because I want to talk to you about how you feel about designer clothes, like what your view is. But mm. save it, save it. Um, it's a bit of a tricky roundabout, isn't it? Mm. Ooh, I'm glad I'm not driving. You're such a confident driver. I you? drive here, there, and everywhere, me. You know what I mean? Oh, look at that. Look at that for you. You like the motorways. sun makes everything pretty. Though. It does. It's like oh Even look. The motorways. It makes it look almost poetic doesn't it like where are they going on their journeys <laughs> <laughs> probably just a junction 14. <laughs> fortunately we have managed to stop up we're gonna get some snacks for the car just got the essentials some diet cokes some twirls and the best flavored chicken crisps in the world chicken oh, look how nice your car is for like a platform for a my car Thank you. Yeah. I chose it deliberately for that. Car just <laughs> I didn't. This. How <laughs> lovely. John wanted a different one, but I said actually I want the one that's. Uh... Would you like a twirl bike? Oh, yeah. I thought I need to get rid of my chewing gum, though. Now, I know that all Cadbury's. Oh, we have to do this. You have to lean right out of shot. <laughs> I know that all Cadbury's is the same, but I think twirl tastes different. Interesting. Yeah, it's got like, dare I say, a saltiness about it. It's not something I'd reach for in the shop. I'd like to expand your horizons, Katie. If you're not familiar, Vista Village is a designer shopping outlet. So it's mostly designer bags, clothes. I think they have makeup and skincare, um, perfume and restaurants. Haven't been in years. The last mm. time I went was when Pearly was a month old. I remember it specifically. It was Valentine's Day and she was one month old and it was very hormonal and I cried the whole way around. Mm. 
as you do yeah. after a month after having a baby and I just remember it being like such a down day and Liam was like let's go to Bista and cheer you up but we hadn't like made a plan we didn't yeah. really know what was there and we just sort of wandered around like oh nothing's in our price range and we don't actually want a five grand coat you know no um, no <laughs> so, it wasn't in the market for one so of them that day it wasn't a great first look round it wasn't my first go I had been it was a child <laughs> <laughs> She's getting choked up about it. thinking about it. But a day. I've done my research now. I've lo watched loads of vlogs. See, I haven't, so. We've got me. Yeah. I've watched loads of vlogs um, and I've prepared myself for what it's like. Um, and designer clothes wise, that's what I wanted to talk to you about. I told you it's going to be such a pretty vlog. Um, <laughs> I'm shaking the car. I'm <laughs> so sorry, taking ages getting it all out. I'm out of touch with vlogging. Um, I have never had designer clothes mm. because two reasons. One, they don't cater for plus size mm. figures typically, although they are getting a bit better. Like Karen Millen now goes does a plus size range, and Needle and Thread have expanded their um, lines up to a size twenty. I would love to see them go a bit further, but it's a good start. Such beautiful dresses they have. So nice. Um, also, the other thing that has always put me off is. Right, obviously the price mm. and for many years I was like why would I buy like why would Liam want a white shirt from you know <clears throat> there when he could just get a white shirt for like 10 times less yeah but in the last couple of years I've started to have an appreciation for not necessarily specifically designer wear but like very high quality clothes and timeless I guess yeah. that I think design is good for timeless yeah I'm saying that I don't have anything designer I used no, to um I, I used timeless. to before the kids um I had a little bit of a thing for designer bags yeah um but I haven't bought anything since the kids I don't think um, maybe today's the day but I like I I've always thought like a bag is more of a classic piece, so therefore you yeah. could almost justify it. Yeah. Um, and you wear anything, a bag more. Yeah. Whereas, I, you know, it's tricky, rented, isn't it? Yes. I've talked about this on Instagram. It's rented. I know, that is amazing. So That's such a nice way. See, yeah, I personally I like wouldn't do that because I don't get the like mm. buzz. Like, I like of. Yeah. of oh, I do you know what I mean? Yeah, I love bags. I love bags so much, I've got my own handbag range. I know. <laughs> like, it's, been, like, it's not an hat, but you know, may as well mention it <laughs> since we're talking about bags. Um, but no, I do. Like, there is something really special about... I, when we when we went on honeymoon, I got a designer bag and there's something just so special about going into the shop and getting yeah, it. Although I always feel a little bit intimidated. We've talk, yeah, so this is why we dress nicely because I always feel... I used to feel like that at makeup counters as well. I just felt mm. a bit like, mm, like I was being judged, like I wasn't good enough. And they but probably they are aren't at all. They're no. probably not. But like, there's always a little bit of a thing thinking that they're thinking. I would love mm. to hear your stories of going into either designer shops or makeup counters um, because years and years ago I made a whole video about feeling confident at makeup counters. Mm. See if it's still... If I've not like got rid of that video if it's still available i'll link it below. i still feel a bit nervous about makeup counters as well i don't know what it is i'm is okay that... with those now i think it's I because like... the the staff like at those places they're always so glamorous yeah whether they, you know whether glamorous, you're a man though. or a woman it's you just great um mm. so we're going to go and have a look i don't like to buy designer things unless they are like really special mm. uh, also again for me it's not usually clothes because of the whole plus size situation but Sometimes I watch vlogs and I see people going, that's nice, that's nice. I think some of those are nice, but do they actually think everything's amazing? Or do they think it's amazing because it is designer? That's what I'm trying to get at. Like, I don't want to just buy something just because it He's is designer. Now. It's... <laughs> it's got to be something that's really, really nice. Who's ringing? It's you. It's me. It's Esther. Let's get back <laughs> on the road. Let's go. That's my thoughts on designer wear. Just saw a sign that said, miles but look at the weather it's really turned it is so pretty here i love it it's very american oh, isn't yeah, it really i like it we're having a bit of a recce at the moment just sort of like mooching around seeing what's where i feel a bit weird about vlogging we both said, i get like, i'm d i'm not the person to be with because i'm really awkward <laughs> nervous energy really, really awkward. so i might film in the shops on my phone because it just feels less i feel like it's better on your phone anyway yeah sometimes. just less so if the camera quality changes because so i'm just going to film like a little bit round what's in there rather than like whipping out a vlog cam being like <laughs> um but i've seen the future shops so we're going to have a look in there aren't we we are Okay, we waited in the virtual queue and now it's our turn to have a little look at the Gucci's. Oh, look at this. 
so sweet, but it's for like a newborn. How much is it? Two hundred and ten pounds. I'll take six. <laughs> very sweet though. <laughs> Saying all that, this is so Darcy and Pearl. This is everything that we are about. It's ruffles, it's bows, it's girly. Dare I look at the cost? Let's have a look. Eighty-five pounds. I mean, than the other one. Yeah, in mm -hmm. fact, for Gucci, that's not bad. So we didn't make any purchases in Gucci. I did have a look at the scarves because I have been thinking about a scarf for a while, um, but I don't know. Just couldn't bring myself to spend that sort of money on I, something I, that's just going to rub around and get makeup on. What do you think? I did, when I was going to say, I did look at a 10 grand bag but decided maybe I'd get that one next week. Get that tomorrow. <laughs> I'll come back later. I'll get that one online. <laughs> I'm joking by the way. <laughs> um, it was, there was, there were some beautiful things in there. I wanted to film more but I don't know what the vibe is on filming in I the I get shops. a little bit, yeah. There's a lot of like, security people walking around I don't know. I don't want to get told off so. I hope that this vlog. Out. Yeah, I don't want to get kicked out being naughty. So I hope that this vlog is turning out okay. We've popped into Kate Spade. I think that's really pretty, but I do have a pink one in my heart collection with LRM, so I don't want to buy another pink one. It's lovely though. It's very pretty. Yeah, well, that's a bit fun, isn't it? Yeah, it's cute. This is similar to that pink one, but just a different colourway. I like the colours of it. Yeah, I like that colour. This is nice. I like that a lot. So we're on the hunt now for a shop called Designer Exchange that I've seen so many people like vlog and Instagram about. It's a pre-love like vintage so second hand, yeah, correct, crackery there, uh, like second hand pre-love designer um, store, um, but we can't find it anywhere. When we asked um, an assistant, she said it might have shut down, but, but I did, only in the last two days. <laughs> yeah, but I did DM them earlier this week saying I will be coming to see you on Thursday, and they were like, great, look forward to seeing you. So surely they would have said you won't be seeing us. We've shut down. So I have great faith that they are still here. I've got a devastating update for you all now, and that is that the designer exchange shop shut on the 20th, on the 19th, and today is the 22nd. So we've missed it. Do you wish that they hadn't said look forward to seeing you or whatever it was yeah. that they said? I wish they had said that before we made the journey out here, but there we are. Um, we good learn. Learn. A good lesson in trust. <laughs> We're we gonna go learn. and have some lunch now. I am so hungry. It is so lovely in here. We've got yeah. such a nice little seat. And we've got a little, bit, yeah, we've got like a little, it's sort of a booth, but not a booth. Oh, the lighting, sorry about that. Um, it's just all like, just very nice. I'm like in France. Like in France. I keep mm -hmm. saying I feel like I'm in America. Smells. Thank, oh, thank you. Thank you so much. I've been vlogging all these years. Mm -hmm. Katie is the exact same as me. I'm but so I, awkward. I feel like it's like I pull my camera out the worst possible time. Um, it smells like America. And um, on the news earlier this week, it was saying the borders are open in America. So we're just like, where can we go? Let's do a trip together and get some of the girls together. We're thinking New York, even though. You know how I feel about New York, but Katie assures me that she'll put together a good itinerary. I feel like this is this is a the view. Of America. Yeah, it does. It does. That's the view outside. I'll show you the food when it arrives. Mm -hmm. Just doing the obligatory take five thousand pictures of our food. <laughs> I've gone from macaroni cheese. Um, I didn't realise it came with no sign. <laughs> well, you got chips, but you thought it might have like some salad, didn't you? <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's give. Macaroni cheese taste test. That is a good mm. macaroni cheese. That's got a nice kick to it. Five star for the macaroni cheese. So we are just picking our desserts, but I thought you might like to see the menu. What dessert would you go for? <laughs> our desserts are here. And Katie, what did you just say about them? They look like soup. <laughs> they look like just two big soups, but they don't look particularly. They're creme brulee, and I want to do the big tap. I know that it's so loud in here, but oh, oh yeah, that made a good one. So we have finished the most lovely lunch, but we're both absolutely so full. Um, we're gonna have a little mooch round more, but I, there's nothing that we've seen that we're like, oh, must have, must have. So we're gonna have a little mooch, and then we think we're gonna head somewhere else of the plan of the day but <laughs> going, along, the word? going rogue off piste. off piste going to have a little look in Stella McCartney here she is 
going in. She just asked me to narrate it. So I'm saying, here she is, going in. <laughs> Look, all the kids' bits. We're such mums. We're in like the most amazing shopping place ever. We're just looking at the kids' things. That's cute. That's really I sweet. Hair. Yeah, I could. I love that. It's a bit young though, a bit small. So we've just done all of down there. And now we are just finishing up. We're going to have a little look in Ted Baker. Oh, yes. I'm drawn to all of these little bits and pieces. The magpie in me is drawn to them. Jazzy. I like the colour on that, that's pretty. Just <laughs> walking back to the car and I just had to note how pretty that little walkway was. And Katie said how nice it would be at night with all those little lanterns. I bet this is so lovely at Christmas time. Yeah, although I did come two days before Christmas once and it was absolutely carnage. <laughs> <laughs> to be fair, Christmas shopping just before Christmas is hellish. Mm. I'm, are you organised with Christmas shopping? Mm. Yeah, no, I am, I'm, I'm okay, I'm more of an online shopper. I don't know where I'm going, that's not your car, I thought that was your car. <laughs> that was not um, your car. Yeah, I'm more of an online shopper. Yes, I might start my Christmas shopping soon and get everything all wrapped up. Anyway, oh. The car next to you is parked very close. Oh my God. <laughs> 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 I can't. <laughs> I can't. If I didn't be funny, I'm not going to tell her that because we already didn't be funny. It's just funny, Katie. <laughs> We're talking. <laughs> I'm a nervous flyer. <laughs> so we're talking about flying because we want to go on a trip together and Katie's like, I'm a bit of a nervous flyer. And I was like, I've never been on a trip okay. on my own. Like, I'll help you, you can't be that bad. And then she told me this, stop. please, please tell it again. It won't be funny. You, <laughs> no, you tell it, you tell it. it wasn't, <laughs> I'm like, no, you, you, you tell it in your funny voice, it's funny. <laughs> I'm telling you it in my funny voice. I'm gonna wee. Are you telling your funny voice? As I understand it, <laughs> Katie is a nervous flyer. And she was on holiday with her husband who, before we had our kids, before they had kids, on her way back from Barbados <laughs> because she's been bougie since the dawn of time. <laughs> it's a cut price holiday, actually. <laughs> was it? Yeah, genuinely. It was like in the days you could go to Barbados for £500. Anyway, well, that's great. besides the point. Good deal, good deal. <laughs> and she's very nervous. And her husband, oh, had just <laughs> her husband had just fallen asleep. <laughs> and then she thought she felt turbulence. Do you impression? That's what got me. That's so he was me. Be, shall I be John? Yeah, I'm not actually going to hurt you. But shall I be so he was, Yeah, so he's like asleep. Okay. And I went <laughs> like this. <laughs> And I went, I'm not going to swear. Can I swear? Yeah, I would swear. I went, John. Like, my eyes are like wide, like saucers. <laughs> and I funny. went, that was the impression of the John. Do it without the glasses. I, I went, John, fucking do something. <laughs> I just stood <laughs> I'm not doing it with it's good because I'm a bit awkward on Imagine the camera. Imagine seeing what I could have to Katie going, fucking do something. And he was like, look around, everybody's but, but chill. But did he know what you were talking about? Yeah, of course he did. He's not, he's used to me. He was like, look around. Come to is, Polo. Yes, please. <laughs> and he was like, no one is even slightly bothered. Like, everybody is chill. And I was going, please, John, do something. Do something. It's funny. Oh. I told it better. I told it better to Louise, but it nearly broke me. I seized up on the camera. <laughs> right. So we are going to Home Sense now. I'm I feel like impressed. that's more my comfort zone than Gucci. Mm. I just went funny with the polo. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um. I feel, I feel like, like all of the terms. I feel like um. It's quite know, hard to get Yeah. It's, <laughs> I feel like Gucci was great, but I, I feel like, that. I give it. me an autumn candle any day. Mm. And you know, I can't enjoy candles anymore. I get mm. headaches from them. That There's only like a few that I can have and enjoy without getting headaches. I think I'm still stuck five years ago. I just love a good old No, everyone wants a Home Sense mm. candle. I just feel like I can't buy anything more from Home Sense because the whole year I've been decluttering. <laughs> and I've got so much. I don't need another pumpkin. 
I don't no, I'm not pumpkin. after a pumpkin. Star wiped to me buying another pumpkin. Yeah, I I mean, don't get me wrong, I'm partial to a pumpkin, but I, I just... a giant pumpkin. I love I'm an autumnal candle. A big pumpkin, like big. I want it big. You've already got a big one. <laughs> <laughs> I want another big one. She's got a, you've got a huge one. Do they know about that? I've got a big one at home. <laughs> I'm, talking. <laughs> I'm talking big. Big. It's really big. <laughs> oh, good. I think he's going to brand deals with this video. I didn't know. I didn't know. Pictures. <laughs> it's just the way. Uh, I didn't know if you'd shown the pumpkin because it's on your. No, I think I have not shown it yet. <laughs> I mean, I don't know if it's that exciting anyway. <laughs> have you shown that big pumpkin of yours? <laughs> <laughs> like it's that exciting. Oh, tell me, have you shown that big pumpkin of yours? There's also, I've noticed, a Claire's Accessories next door. Mm -hmm. And my girls love Claire's Accessories. Um, not sponsored by Claire's Accessories. Although I did work with Claire's once. It was great. Went to New York with them. Oh, did God. you? Yeah. Wow. Oh, great. Got to see Frozen on Broadway and everything. Oh, my God. It was really good. I'd love to. I want um, to see Pretty Woman. Mm -hmm. Anyway, that's another story. Anyway. So I would like to nip into Claire's. Oh. Although I just think I look a bit done up, like I'm wearing a nice dress. I've <laughs> got my like, bougie Karen Mi Mir Miller. <laughs> Karen Miller earrings. I've got my designer bag that I've rented. I just feel like I look a bit much for... This was a very Bista Village outfit. Yeah, like... I'm just gonna own it though. So I felt, I felt like I was okay in Bista Village, but I feel like great. Home Sense and oh, Claire's like, is more my comfort zone. And mine. Not that I ever like my kids don't. Well, they do like Claire's. They do like Claire's, actually. Oh, I'll tell a lie. Jolly good. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Here we are. We're in Milton Keynes Home Sense. I've not been in this one before, but we've got Halloween oh, yeah, and also yeah, yeah, yeah. Christmas. What? Oh, little ballerinas. I got big excited. That is so cute. I love that. Good spot. Thanks got really excited about this thinking oh what's like boo ice cubes so they say boo on them um it says spooky chills and thrills but it's just squares There's nothing spooky about squares get away with your spooky <laughs> whatever you're gonna sh get in my shot if you had to have any of this pink furniture which piece would you have i think i would go for the sofa because it just looks the most comfortable my friend is having a baby girl next week I've got her those bits and I'm also highly tempted by the notebooks although I don't need any more notebooks but they're all just so bloody appealing I shouldn't be excited about this but I am excited for seasonal kitchenware this reminds me of my friend Marie this is very bits and clipsy I think home now and as you can see let me get into some like decent lighting I have like oh, cried oh Katie's here. She was having some time with the with Rocky. I don't even know which one it is. It's Rocky. It's oh, Rocky. It's Rocky. I've cried my makeup off. Oh, um, I'm just gonna open a window because it's warm. What is with this weather, Katie? Why is it? I don't it... know. I've got too many things on the window still. Yeah, well, that's the age I am. <laughs> that age I'm... Right. She is. <gasps> Who's this? Say hello, everybody. Hello. <laughs> hello. Um. <laughs> So after we went to Home Sense, we popped into Claire's accessories. I don't think we vlogged in Claire's, did we, Katie? No. I don't think we did. I showed um, this. You were showing this. Pearly loves. What do you love to wear on your fingers? Rings. Rings. What sort of rings do you love the most? Colouring. Colouring rings. Should we show this close up so people can see your lovely colouring rings? <laughs> Hang on a second, it's focusing. There we go. So we found these rings. These were... How much were you? Eight pounds, but we on like a deal. I pick those up for you. And you've got a popper dom and a prawn cracker in your hands. Just editing some pictures. Often I get asked, what do you edit your pictures on? I just use Lightroom um, and I just use the presets. But look who's come in to see me and show me your fancy rings. Oh, they are nice. Are they your fancy rings? Yeah. And we've got a crown on. You look absolutely good. Oh, what's that naughty cat doing? That's a ballerina pose. That's beautiful. <laughs> That's gorgeous. Can you do any other poses? <laughs> yeah. That's gorgeous. Can you do any dances? Any ballet dances? Beautiful. Yeah. That is beautiful, Pearl. 
Beautiful, good girl. Okay, Pearl wants to show us a trick. I'm ready. Whoa, that was a good trick. Well done. It's been several hours. It's been several hours and 15 days. I don't know why I'm staring It's actually not. It's been like an hour, but the sun's gone down, so it feels like it's been a long time. Um, I say that like, it feels like it's been forever. But Katie, we've been together for like 12 hours today. We've done, we've done well. Well, great time. I've enjoyed it. I mean, it. yes, very good. <laughs> it's been a long time. Is that too high for a little... Yeah. Yes. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Um, so we're ending the vlog here. Thank you for watching. Um, and what does a snake go? Pardon? What does a snake go? Where does a snake go? Yeah. Go what, then, what do you tell us? You tell me. What does a snake do? in a hole. Okay. What, <laughs> what sound does the snake make? Do you know? That's right. Oh, and the cat's eating a headband. It's all done. Oh, Pearl's, Pearl's doing the snake now. Um, it's been so nice to vlog with you today. I, I feel know, like yes. I've had my vlog mojo back Yeah, I've been in, I, I, I feel the same. Not that I vlogged, but. <laughs> and now I'm doing, I served up and I go, now I'm going all awkward this again. Is, this is sh like, in the shops and people are like, enjoy your shopping. I'm like, you too. Yeah. And they're like, they're not shopping. <laughs> or when you used to like say I love you to your teacher by mistake. Or is that just me? <laughs> right. I'm going to say a proper goodbye to Katie, so goodbye to you. Um, thank you for following along. Leave a friendly and comment. Oh, and, and goodbye from you. And goodbye bye from bye. you.